The last 12 to 18 months has seen probably more new boat owners than I have ever witnessed before. If you're a new boat owner or just getting into the fishing scene, one of the most stressful things that we can do is go to that boat ramp the first few times and not put that boat in the water right away, you have to make lots of adjustments. None of us want to, you know, back up, pull forward, back up, pull forward. We want to go ahead and, and, you know, get that boat in the water the first time, especially on a busy weekend. We don't want to take up, you know, the entire ramp for an extended period of time. Well, as somebody that has gone to literally hundreds of boat ramps all over the country, probably the number one thing that I see as far as new boat owners working on backing up or learning how to back up that boat has to do with over correction and let me go ahead and explain that a little bit as you're backing your boat trailer up and you go ahead and turn the wheel and you see your trailer tires start to move over and your trailer starts to move as soon as that trailer turns starts to turn you can go ahead and start to put the wheel back towards that center or straight position if you wait to put that wheel back until that tire or the back corner of your trailer is where you want it to be it's too late and that's when the overcorrection comes in so as you're backing up as that trailer starts to go okay now i can straighten the wheel out and go the other way with it so it's really about small movements i remember when i first started the back of boat up i was making too large of movements so it's about small movements and start to straighten it out sooner than you might think and a real easy way to be able to do this is not to go too fast when we try to back up too quickly when we're first learning it's super easy to over correct now some uh, anglers like to look back over their shoulder i like to use the side mirrors either one is whatever you're comfortable with but really really make sure that as you are backing that boat up once you see that trailer okay it's going the way i want it to go start to straighten it out and then it will follow through and i think you're going to have a lot of success at the boat ramp you know pulling into restaurants as you're traveling gas stations whatever it might be and hey if you would like to watch a video on what i think is the number one mistake for loading a bass boat, a boat on bunks, go ahead and check this video out right here. And make sure you go out and encourage someone today. You never know how you might just change their life. For the Bass Fishing Life, I'm your host, Steve Rogers.